just sort of displayed to go, what, what a wonderful room they've been for being so quiet. Well done. No shot. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm going to do my best over here to make sure this sounds how these guys deserve it to sound, and that is like a world class sound. Uh, and you guys are going to make sure that it's going to be a world class room in terms of the audience side of things, aren't you? Yeah! Uh, and I know that you're just saying yes, well, most of you are just saying yes because of my threatening demeanor. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. You're Scottish! It's not easy! And, you know, the only reason you got away with that is because you're not Scottish. <laughs> you're Scottish. They're already being some kind of... Is he not Welsh? Eh? He's not That's fucking well, I'll tell you that. Um, <laughs> So, the reason that I'm going to do that and you guys are going to do that is because these people up here are some of the most talented musicians I've ever met in my fucking very, very little shop. My very long life, and uh, I was lucky enough to go and uh, watch them over in Liverpool recently support another band who are some of the best musicians in the whole wide world. The reason, everyone to shut the the reason they got invited... Yeah, I'll, I'll, I won't do that story. I'll, I'll post it in my highlights and in my, in my uh, Instagram. It's very funny. Um, can't take me anywhere. But the reason they got invited over to support this band is because they're fucking amazing. And you're in for an absolute treat. But only, I mean, it'll be a treat. It'll be a treat in a fucking noisy room. It'll be a treat in any kind of room. It'll be a treat in a fucking bus station. But it'll be an even better treat if we can just be fucking whiskey jar silent for the whole, the whole time. Can we do that? Yeah! Can we fucking do it? Yeah! yeah. Right. Whiskey jar. This is your last chance to make some noise for three songs. Please put your hands together for the deep blue! Come on!
and bite Oh, the waters lose and try They may watch and know the landmarks <laughs> This is a song, uh, I guess it's a kind of love song for autumn, I suppose, the rubber song. Sunglasses 
deep blue lockdown song. Everyone has one. Everyone has, I'd say, most fans have multiple actually. And Jordan always introduces this one by like starting off saying that she was, she wrote the song 17 days into lockdown and she was forced to move in with her very lovely boyfriend, which she then says, I always think it's going to go another way. I <laughs> was forced to move in with my lovely boyfriend, who's actually here tonight, so you better say to me no to your job. <laughs> no, we had a, well, I'll continue, we just yeah. go. Uh, yeah, I was forced to move in with my wonderful boyfriend over there. Yeah. Don't all look at him. Uh, I mean, you can if you want. It's gorgeous. Um, but, uh, yes, and I guess Covid was scary, but those first few months of lockdown were actually blissful and peaceful, and we just got to spend those time together in a way that we'd never been able to before. So, this one is called Cotton White Linen. It's the last song.
Christ, you cunts! Come on! That was fucking low class! Get some noise! See you for free! Yeah. Make some noise for the people! 